Hello. Uh, this is going to go out to people on my Facebook groups, like Families Forward Project. I need to say a few things. There are, maybe some of you are getting upset at me because I'm not getting back to you. Well, right now I'm driving back from my daughter's work at Kroger. I am the only licensed driver. So I am keep, been keeping busy with my family. I drive my ex-wife to and from work. I drive my ex-wife's niece, Tracy. Because this is her van, not mine. I haven't been able to do anything other than that. Now, if you people, like one said, if I care. Well, I'm getting this out in the open, okay? I have to help people in my family. I want to interview everyone so please be patient and you know I don't call at a certain time well many times I, I have family that last minute they need to go here or go there and of course since I do not have a vehicle of my own because of an accident that I had going on three months ago I am at the I have to use whatever vehicle I have so I do want to interview people okay I do want to have, write it for my next book this is the reason why I haven't been able to contact anyone and there are times I am so exhausted from trying to do everything for everyone else I do not have time to be able to put in for the interviews for people plus also the time difference one person is in Illinois he's got his own thing going on and this also goes for that person if all you've got to do is just go after uh, CPS I admire you for that I'm also promoting my own book. People are helping me and I say thank you. I believe more has to be done to expose CPS. But please, you know, many times just texting out or typing out your story helps. If it's bigger, then break it into smaller chunks. But please, allow me to just get to you when time allows me. Many times, I've got people that at the last minute, oh, uh, I've got to go here, I've got to go there. Now, my ex-wife's niece, Tracy, she uh, usually waits until later on. But other people, you know, my daughter, she has to go to him from work. So, I understand that. And my ex-wife, she has to go to him from work. But sometimes, it's just, hey, let's go here, let's go there. So, if you really want me to call you. Look, I'm going to have to say I will do my best, but please, have patience. I know your story is important, but also don't limit me. Don't say, oh yeah, I want my story, but I, I, I want to wait. Then just tell me when it would be a better time, okay? That's all I'm asking. Because... I'll tell you right now, this is an important matter. This year is the year we have to get this stuff out. CPS is not sitting back. This is a war. So please, 
Just be patient. I will get to you. I will interview you. So I can get your story in my next book. Just understand that I don't sit around all day and do nothing. I I took this on and it's a lot of work. So to everyone that contributed their stories, thank you. To those that want to be in my next book, contact me either at all lowercase David Short 200 at yahoo.com or go to my face, Facebook page, you know, Justice Denied, or just check me on Facebook. Whenever you want to talk, you know, you can call me, and if I don't answer, I will call you right back. Thank you.